Hello Exploders and welcome back to some more Dead Rising 3 with me Exploding Ember. Today as you can see we are back with some more zombies. Uh, you probably guessed that, that's probably just why you're here. Cause these zombies are going to die. Oh my god the flying slicey slicer attack. It's pretty awesome. Oh my ex might die. So let's see what we can do today. Last uh, episode, I think, went up a uh, couple days ago. And I think someone just died in the game. That's kind of depressing. Come back to life. Who are you? Oh, look, there's a guy up there. Dan. Let's go see. He's, um... What is he doing? Oh, he's dinged. Ding! Oh, he died. Cindy! I will get this harpoon thingy gun and destroy the zombies and save you I I don't see you anymore Cindy where are you where is she so this is like a crossbow sort of thing it's pretty cool pretty cool what was that zombie just doing he was just like holla it's pretty cool alright let's throw this dynamite woo cover it's gonna explode well that completely missed. Oh look at the lovely texture of the bottom of this car. It looks amazing. Okay jump jump. Oh. Yep. Oh my god. Zombies just like explode into loads of parts and just like fly everywhere. It's awesome. Seriously if you don't have this game already and you have an x Force 1 I definitely recommend getting it because it's, it's amazing. Oh my god. Sorry I'm a little bit hyper today. Yes. Okay, zombies, get out the way. Stop ca- stop- Yeah, words. Stop catching me on fire. Yeah, tell me about it. Cookie! Oh my god! Leave my foot alone. Oh, sorry. Broke your plane. Where's the cockpit? Where's the, uh, pilot? stuff. Oh, uh, I think he's over there. Wow, oh, Jesus, that went far. Oh my god, look at them all. They're everywhere. Just making sure there's nothing behind me. Oh look, I think there's a guy down there somewhere. Yep, yeah, there's a guy down there. Let's see if I can help him out a little bit. Come on. Oh, he's, he's on the floor. Oh, he's back up. But he did just get bitten, so surely he's a zombie now, right? Come on, I'm coming for you. Duh. Oh. Why do they blow themselves up? Is it because they don't want to turn? Probably. That would make sense. Anyway, Dylan. Goodbye, Dylan. Dylan, no! Let me on the car, please. The badly textured car. Okay, go. Okay, run! Run! Jump! Ah, there we go. We're on the car now. Oh my god, I'm covered in blood gonna shoot the oh it died okay so now all we got is a shovel so we dig some dig some more zombies up yeah it's going well I heard that throughout this game there are never you you will never see two zombies that look exactly the same. I mean, the actual zombies themselves they they only have like a couple like characters, but the clothing it always changes. So there's no identical zombies, which is pretty awesome. Like having thousands of zombies on the screen at any one time and none of them being exactly the same. And oh my god, I'm gonna die! Oh, get away from me! Get away! No, come on, please, please don't die. Come on. Be careful with that one. Oh, it's a seesaw. Someone get on the other end. Okay, now we've got to be really careful because we're going to die if we don't. Okay. Come on, get around here. Hopefully there's some health over here. Is there? Yes. Some pills. Headache pills. Definitely need some of them. There we go. Die. Pick up the fire axe. Alright, let's take some more pills. Come on. Okay. 
There we go, pretty much full health now. Oh, what's this? Oh, save game. Awesome, we're now saved. Wow, that was a lot faster than Dead Rising 2. Jesus, that took ages to save. You have to go into the, that little menu, didn't you? Right. Oh my god. There are so many zombies in this game. It's unbelievable. It's amazing though, because like, it gives you a lot of stuff to do. Oh, my weapon died. No. Don't kill me, please. Look at them all. They're all just like piled up down there. Haha, <laughs> look at that one. She's like chilling with her legs, like climbing up the wall. It's quite cool. Quite funny. Okay, so where do, where, where do we go? What do we do? Let's get this lead pipe. Lead pipe. Some soft drink. No, thank you. Right. <clears throat> I think we should try and clear this area out down there before we try and open the door. Because I think we have to go through there. But I, I'm going to clear this area out first because, you know, it's a good thing to clear the area out. Words are a little bit hard. Yeah, I'm a wee bit tired. But I wanted to get this video out for you guys. I'm going to do the, uh, hopefully do another video over the weekend. Another Dead Rising 3 video if you want. Don't forget, at the top there will be an annotation somewhere. Basically showing you the previous episode. So yeah, if you want to see that, if you haven't seen this one yet, I should have said that near the beginning, but oh well. Yeah, if you haven't seen the first episode yet, go to the top of the screen. There will be an annotation up there somewhere. Yeah. And then you can watch it. Okay. Door. The door wouldn't open, so I have no idea what to do. Right. Let's have a look. Nothing up here. Right, so I've just been running around for ages, and uh, I'm an idiot, basically, because I have to come up here. Almost there. <laughs> come on then, Nick. Let's do this. Get the water. Oh, what was that? A large wrench. Don't mind if I do. Get rid of the spade. We don't need the spade. It's nearly dead. Nope, I don't want the cra crate. No, I don't want the spade. I want the crowbar. Okay, good. Good. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's a bowing knife. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Oh, Rhonda, over with you. oh I think we did it. It's going to be a cutscene now, I think, so I'll be quiet. Jesus Christ, what the hell was that? Like, we don't have enough problems already. You okay, Nick? Hi, Annie. Thought you guys were goners. You find anything? Maybe some food or a gun? I found this out there. It might be useful. I gotta get out of here, man. You got a family to get back to? Parents? Don't have any. Me neither. Yeah, sometimes you're better off that way. Is that your last dose? We're almost out of everything. Ha! You know, if your kind had just got Zombrex chipped like responsible citizens, we might not be in this mess. Those people are tracked by GPS. They're prisoners. They're following the law. Those GPS chips have Zombrex in them. They keep infected people from turning zombie. Oh, really? Must not have worked too well. Look outside. Ugh, you illegals are nothing but trouble. Uh, Will you bitches shut up? They're gonna hear us. You know, why don't you call the hell down, asshole? As long as they're outside, we got nothing to worry about. No, what the hell? Dude. What? You idiot. He is such an idiot. Oh, no. Now they know we're here. Really? Oh, what's gonna happen now? Well, they can't get in because the window's there. I don't think they're back there, are they? Peter, I'm so scared. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, that might be a problem. So zombies have learned how to use guns now. We are all going to die! No! Why would you do that? If you wanted to survive, why would you run out where the zombies are? You're dead? Oh, yeah, they're ripping his body up, but his body's still intact. Okay, oh, would you like some sausages? <laughs> wow, that was lovely. Okay, oh my god. Get ready to run. There's a lot of puke. Go. My garage in Ingleton. The walls are thick, it'll buy us some time to think. Maybe the TV will work. 
If we have to get out of here, that's fine, but I'm not going to any garage. People are waiting for me. Girly, you're better off with us. I'll take my chances. Eddie! Nick, those zombies are going to get in here any second. We got to do something. There's nothing to fight them off with. You're good at fixing things. There's a lot of stuff around here. That is true. That's what Dead Rising is all about. Building stuff, Nick. Come on. Right, so I take it we have to get okay. the sledgehammer. And what is this? The cement saw. Oh, the classic cement saw, sledge saw thing. Oh, yeah. Right, let's destroy these zombies. Okay. That's not really being that effective. Yeah, let's go to the back door. Good idea, Nick. That's exactly what I was thinking. Why won't you just open the door? Why do you have to kick it? Oh, wow, you are getting cut in half, zombies. You don't even stand a chance. Okay, that was wrong. Rondo and Dick. Okay, so I think that's all we have time for today, guys. I'm just going to kill these few zombies. And next time, we'll go with Rhonda and Dick to get to Rhonda's garage in Ingleton, I think. So, yeah. Hope you all had a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Have a good day, guys.